maybe I'm not an American citizen. And some people said, ah, he has a forged birth certificate. Well, first of all, um, uh, it's true, I'm not an American. I, mean, I, I was not born in Hawaii. I wasn't born in the United States of America. Uh, I come from Kenya. And so I think people saw my election as uh, as proof, as testimony that our society has continued to become more and more nice. What's popping? We back with another requested video. As I always like to express in all my other videos, I am not here to turn non-believers into believers. I'm only here to bring y'all food for thought. And with that being said, your opinion is your opinion. Let's get right down to it. Now y'all clearly just heard that Barry himself, aka Obama, really just told y'all that he's not from America and he's not from Hawaii. He's from Kenya. So with that being said, the seal has been broken. They have officially violated the Constitution. They let an outsider, a foreigner, take leadership of our country. Y'all let me know what y'all thought. See it down in the comment because now it's starting to show as far as the backlash of all the things that was put in motion due to this individual such as the trans movement let's not forget about the cop killings of male black men at a rapid speed let's not forget how obama tried to bring this obamacare that would allow your children to decide whether or not they want to change their gender let's not forget that we were also fooled by this same individual that had put a male aka man as the first lady in the house y'all let me know what y'all thoughts is down below this political politics global dictatorship that they got going on y'all is falling the cabal has finally fell and we're starting to see everything not only that everything that they tried to keep in the dark is coming to the light with that being said our deepest fear is that we are not inadequate our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measures it is our light not our darkness that frightens us the most we gotta step up to these individuals when we see them doing nefarious things to our country y'all we gotta step up to these individuals when we are being treated less than human we have to step up to these individuals when they are taken and using our children as sacrifices for their own rituals and games y'all this is something that we got to really stay focused to and as i always say clear eyes always recognize real lies so we really got to pay attention because these individuals think they got us fooled these individuals pull the flip-flop on us because they think we don't pay attention we have to stand up as one and unite and come together and with that being said y'all already know i always got more so until next time